Royal Oak Police tell me that overnight at least seven businesses in and around downtown Royal Oak were burglarized. burglarized. Two of them right here, Robin Manugian about Face Beauty Spa and this one right next door, Iconic. Both of them share the same front door here. You can see where the lock was pried off. It was really sh a big shock when I showed up this morning at 7.45 and just saw that both businesses, both of my families, were broken into today. Both our doors, uh, About Face and Iconics, were uh, pried open. And that's when I realized that someone broke in. Um, from that point, I walked into About Face, saw that their cash drawer was everywhere, um, and then I called 911. And then as I was on the phone on hold, I realized that um, we were broken into also. And our cash drawer was everywhere, all over the floor. Papers were everywhere, bills were everywhere. Um, it was a mess. There was papers everywhere. Then I finally got into Iconic, and um, we have a metal box, and they literally tore the metal box apart and just ripped off everything that we had in our file cabinets, looked for any cash that they could possible. They were going after everything, uh, all my quarters, my pennies, everything was gone. I think I have like five nickels left out of everything that I had in that drawer. From these two businesses alone, it appears that a total of around $1,200 was taken. Again, I did check in with Royal Oak Police. They tell me at least seven businesses broken into and burglarized overnight. At this point, they do not have any information on suspects. It's still way too early, they say, to say whether the same person is responsible for all of them. They are still working on processing all of the scenes. Reporting live in Royal Oak, Anu Prakash, Channel 7 Action News. You know, Anu, it's so frustrating. We know Robin Manugian. She does some makeup work for us at the station here but you know these small business owners work so hard to make their money and it's such a shame when you see something like this they do and we know robin well robin has been here for i think probably 20 years at this place i believe she said and never any problems before the folks here at iconic are new to this area so they never imagined anything like this would happen but royal oak police tell me that in the last several weeks they have had other situations like this they're still trying to see if all of them are connected